I just have like a big goofy grin right now. This is this has been such a transformation. Or we put the dinosaur and the garland in here. Where would you like me to organize your googly eyes? I always wanted to hang this on that wall. Ah, he's like it's too big. Ah, does he fit on the top? Some of them are leggings, so I think I'm gonna put uh, the leggings with the okay. leggings. Okay. Uh, do you know what time it is? I just looked. Uh, it's probably like one now, isn't it? I'm dead. I can die and die happy because I have a clean house for the first time in my adult life. I feel empowered. My space has been made. It's time to get organized because we have been working our butts off for the last few days and have done some very productive things and yeah. I was just joking but you're Do now it, please? Is, now it. it's time to like get it done. We are done with all of the decluttering that mm -hmm. is behind us. Today is all about getting everything organized. I love rushing through the declutter because it keeps you focused and then you're just done and you feel mm -hmm. so good. You feel like like there's chaos going on on the other side of the tripod but does it stress you out? No because I know where everything's going. Perfect. Kind of, for the most part. Yeah, we'll figure out all the spots. But <laughs> now it's just about getting everything organized and sorted away so you can have a calm home, kind of a blank canvas. It's gonna feel good. I'm ready for it. To start, I do want to work on all of the Christmas organizing, the holiday organizing, but in order to do that, we need to shuffle around some of the clothes in the closet. That's what I'm gonna do first. I think I'll also go ahead and put sweatshirts, things like that with the coats. Winter, winter. and then this is summer clothes. Ideally, she would like to have all of her clothes hanging up, so that's something that we're gonna work on. So for now, I'll just pull these out and we will get to these later. And we have seasonal clothes. We'll probably store away because all of these seasons have passed. Okay, next up, I'm gonna work on relocating all the clothes over here behind me. I'm not a therapist, but I often think of what I do to be a form of declutter therapy because when I'm helping my clients declutter their homes, I know going into it that it's never just about the stuff, that there are so many layers built up into the stuff and that's what I'm trying to get to the heart of as we work together because I know if we can get to the heart of it, then we can start to make real lasting progress. Before we do that, we have to learn about the stories that our stuff tells. It tells our history, it tells us of our emotional attachments. Then we have to start asking the really hard questions like, what were the behaviors that led me to this point? Because if you wanna move forward, we have to start changing those behaviors so that you don't find yourself in the same spot next year. It's never just about throwing away stuff for the sake of throwing it away or donating it. Decluttering with the Space Maker Method is about taking more of a mindful approach to decluttering so that we can really understand why we are here and how we can course correct so that we can move forward. This kind of personal work that you do with decluttering is no joke and sometimes as you're going on this journey you're going to discover that it's not always easy to do it alone and sometimes you're going to need to talk to somebody who can help you facilitate the process of growth and understanding throughout all of this. And that's why I'm excited to introduce today's sponsor, BetterHelp, because we all have so much to deal with in life, but we don't have to deal with it alone. What BetterHelp does is they connect you with a licensed therapist who is trained to listen and give you helpful, unbiased advice. And they make it so easy that you can do it from your phone. To get started, you just answer a simple questionnaire and you can even select if you want a therapist who is more gentle in their approach or more direct, depending on whatever personality works best for you. And then you get matched with a therapist, usually within 48 hours, and you can message them or video chat or talk on the phone with them however you feel most comfortable. Let BetterHelp connect you to a therapist who can support you all from the comforts of your own home. You can visit betterhelp.com slash spacemaker or during sign up, you can choose our channel name Spacemaker Method for a special discount for your first month. If we don't 
fill this completely, we'll be able to put some of her nice handbags in here, which we were wondering where we could store those, so that might work. For now, I'm gonna go ahead and change the remaining plastic hangers that she has to these, just so that everything going in this closet, we already know has the right hanger on it. I love velvet, because the clothes also don't fall off. The ones that she had just folded over a hanger, I'm gonna go ahead and try and hang up for her, just so that she sees the sleeve so they don't get lost way back in here. And I'm gonna go ahead and start just kind of roughly organizing this, trying to put dresses with sleeves down here, start creating some system for her. Oh, it's looking good. Okay, I found these. We are gonna use these for extra clothes storage, try and clear out some of the dressers in the other room, but right now I'm just gonna put them in the closet where they go. We're starting to take everything to its final home, but it is still a process. But they fit perfectly down here. We can even put one more right in there. For okay, and now this one is empty and it's ready for all of this. Now that the closets are set, this one is completely empty. Uh -huh. So I think it's best to put all of the holiday storage and stuff away in here. So as soon as we get this pile organized and put away, it's gonna just free up all of the space. Yes. This is our mountain of boxes. We have so many, none of these have been purchased. We, these are all things that we found during the declutter, which is why I always recommend never buy anything until after you declutter because you never know what you're going to uncover. And what we've decided today is to just reuse these mm -hmm. because decluttering takes multiple passes. This is just the <clears throat> first pass for Danny, and as she starts to use the stock of things that she uncovered, it's gonna get smaller and smaller. So it's kind of a waste of money to buy things to get everything super organized now. For now, these work really great for today. I'll do like a row of three and then we'll just pull everything out. And okay, cool. Put them in. Is this Halloween stuff? Yes. Let's just start with the Halloween box, I guess. Okay. Do you wanna store Halloween sweaters with the Halloween box? Or do you want the I Halloween sweaters I think I want all the separate? clothes separate. Okay, that's fine. That works right. perfectly. This is gonna be the Christmas box. Oh, she says that as she holds ghost. Halloween box. Okay. So this is an autumnal box. And then we have costumes down here that we can add to this box. Switch these guys. And a lot of this can be like Maleficent. Of course you have a dinosaur, a blow up dinosaur, of course. Hmm. Are these, these are for Halloween? Oh no, we might have to have an extra... Yeah. Is this stuff for your classroom as well? Some of it, yes. Some of it, no. Okay. A lot of it's for my house. You know what's funny? The fact that this is what I have for Halloween after downsizing this last fall. I could cushion Oops. the dinosaur with these. Or we put the dinosaur and the garland in here because that's With not in Garland. Oh, okay. I mean, we could combine some of the Christmas. Do you want it all to fit in one box? Is that better for you? It or... doesn't have to. Okay. Mm -hmm. We might be able to store some of the stuff in that box, and that's a hard shell box. I'm thinking things wouldn't be likely to break at all. Okay. Just write it. But do you think the dinosaur can fit? I can make it fit. Do you want to do the, the glasses too? No. Okay, no. Those are regular sunglasses. They don't need to be beholden just to Halloween and my goofy ass behavior. <laughs> Halloween is my favorite. Next we'll work on all of the Christmas stuff because we'll want to put it in the closet first. So I'm going to dump out this box with fabric so that we can use it for the gifting. So we'll also probably just simultaneously do gifting and Christmas. Okay. Because I want to pull out all of the bags and stuff, potentially, and put them with I the like gifts. That. Does that work? Yes. Okay, then we'll have room to shove the wreath, the wreath in here. Okay. 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 Oh, found more Halloween stuff. Ooh, okay, perfect. <laughs> all right. So we'll do gift wrapping in this box and then we'll make this one Christmas. Okay, so gift Ooh. wrapping. Sorry, that's okay. Oh, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hollows. It's Halloween, Halloween right? Christmas, oh, right? Are 
these gifts. Gift boxes. Okay. Okay. Should I also put cards in with the... I think so, because that, that's how you'll use them, right? Mm -hmm. Cards in there? Okay. I'm just going to take that for the time being. I'll Ooh. put the bags here for now. Gift tags. Wrapping paper. A bunch of cards. And we'll see. Okay. Who wouldn't want to give gifts whenever you have a really organized gift box? It's very personal. Oh, that's also Halloween. Oh, and there's a lot of cards, yeah. Nice gift bags, gift bags. Oh, yeah. oh my gosh, season. half of my decorations for Christmas are gift, gift packages. That just trash. Where did I put the cards? I have I cards already. I saw right them earlier. Oh, you have more cards? Yes, out in out in the wild. I am going to go get them. Okay. These are the stars that we took out from her bedroom. Now we can put them in here. Okay. Um, Does all of the ribbon go with gifting or with decor? That is a very good question. And do the Lilabo go with gifting or decor? Gifting. Okay. I'll just put them in the decor for now because I feel like your gift box is going to be so giant. Yes. For now. <laughs> oh, perfect. You found them? Actually, I think I'm going to take these and put them in with the perfume stuff. Cause... Oh, yeah. This is all your Christmas decor? I feel like it's not. Do you have a Christmas tree? Like a big size? Oh, I'm an idiot. What? It's in the rice box under the TV. Oh. <laughs> all of, like, the big Christmas decor. Oh, okay. That's fine. Yeah. I'll just leave it there for now. Perfect. So actually, I can fit in the rest of the Christmas stuff. Then we can fit the, the ha Halloween Halloween extras. Okay, cool. Some of the stuff, yeah, we'll just it works that yeah. way. So we're gonna roll with it. Okay. And I like that this box is protected, so mm -hmm. glass things don't yeah, get broken. Exactly. So. Oh wait, it's Halloween. Perfect. Okay. One box done. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Shall we put it up? Yeah. We decided okay. to put this this closet in yeah. this one. Okay. Oh, how do we think? They're not they're too deep this way, so like that. That works. Do we have a prettier side? Not really. That way, at least you get some green and red. Yeah. Packaging that in a tree. And maybe you'll see your um, Halloween box and think, mm. oh, that's my Halloween box. Yeah. Okay, perfect. So now we just need to add the gifts to this box. Oh, I'll look at all the gift bags. <laughs> okay, they're already on the bottom, so this box might be a little jumble. Um, and then gift bags forever. Oh, more Christmas gift bags. Okay. <laughs> They're all going to be kind of Ooh, hiding. On I top. hope these can fit. These little guys down there. Okay, is that all the gift yes. stuff? Please fit. Oh yeah, it's going to fit. Nice. How do you feel about your gift box? I'm going to feel real good about it as soon as I get the lid on it. Oh. Hey, go ahead and put this guy on the bottom. While Danny is tracking down the lid, I'm going to work on this corner here. There are a lot of air purifiers here, and we would like to put them around the house, but she's looking for the replacement filters. So we don't want to let them go, but they're not of use right now. So I think I'm just going to store them on the ledge, and it's something that she'll have to come back to later. <laughs> um, perfect. Did you find the lid? I did. Perfect. That looks really good. So this is the start of the storage. When was the last time you had all the gifts and everything out and Christmas stuff this organized? Never. Like and they were in the shopping bag when I was bringing them <laughs> home from the store, but never. Looks good. Yeah. I think it will be more functional. Even though you say out of sight, out of mind, I think closed storage with clear, clear. containers is 
usually the right formula for mm -hmm. most people. I took this bar off and it's behind this at the very bottom. Okay. Like it's just right back over there, but that'll give us a little bit more space mm -hmm. for organizing. The home goods, uh, what is this? The home electronics department is looking much calmer. You're gonna go through the vacuums and eventually decide which ones to keep for now. We'll leave mm -hmm. them. These will eventually be gone whenever they're set up in your house. And this area will just get smaller over time. Next up, check. it's just holiday, okay, seasonal, so we'll just leave it like this for now. It's not folded the best, but today is about getting all done. Perfect. Okay. Actually, Danny, why don't we do it like this? Because we might be able to put two, one more here, possibly, and then we put four. We'll, we'll see. Are these all the same size? Yeah. Oh. And we have a seasonal snowman. We might be able to squeeze right here. Okay. What do you yep, think? I see what you're. I see let me your vision. The snowman. Ah, he's like it's too big. Man. Ah, does he fit on the top? I might be able. To... Is that practical? For now. <laughs> For now. You can't get to your art or to your gifting, at the moment. That's the only thing. Okay. Maybe on top is better. If we can shove the seasonal sweaters into the short one, then we'll have more space on top. Swap the green oh. one for this guy. <laughs> Is it stuck? I'm stuck. So, we'll do this. And now I can fold these. That was bugging me a little bit, but I <laughs> I, I know that we're like going for speed, so I Wait, there was no, no. The sweaters are so bulk, are so bulky. Uh -huh. Rolling isn't going to be nope, any it doesn't any change better. anything. Yeah. I think it's gonna work. Oh, this is costume. That can shove in the costume box. <laughs> Not too Not bad. bad. Okay. Cool. We did it. <laughs> so now this one will fit, and then the snowman can go on. Yeah. Top. There we go. I think for your sake, we should go ahead and just put tape and a label on these so that you know what they are. Okay. So we're just gonna add tape and then write the name right on the box. Next one is gifts and gift wrapping. Okay, for now, I think we're done with this closet. We'll come back for the bottom part in just a little bit, but everything is there. Do you think you'll forget about this stuff now? I don't think so. I don't think so either. <laughs> I labeled it 2.0 as to not forget the first edition. Ah, uh, I the love chaos that. The chaos and the clutter and forgetting the, everything. Yeah. How good does it feel when you close the door? That's... Mm. out of it so I went ahead and I put all of the fabric in this box so this is the mm -hmm. first art box so we can just seal that off you could go ahead and label the end if you want okay for storage and then we'll work on getting the rest of the stuff stored away and then this will be the next one for art so of the art supplies here mm -hmm. we have a ton of paper what oh no Is that all the art? Is this art acrylic? Yes. Okay. Should we do the thing and like pull it all out and see what's there? Because I don't actually know yeah. what's all in there. Okay. Yeah, we didn't even really declutter these because it was just it was the art stuff. It was art, and, and it was all in one art. place. Yeah. So one thing that we could do is just kind of get this roughly organized today, mm -hmm. and then. You can go, that's Halloween. Huh. We should go ahead and just put the Halloween right over yeah. there. Yeah. Oh, and here's holidays. What I love about the holidays. Oh, that's cute. Put the, oh, with the, yeah. right there. Oh, that was pretty fast. And the pile is so much smaller. Can you tell she's a teacher? <laughs> Where would you like me to organize your googly eyes? Art? Yeah, School? let's put those in art. Okay. They're going in here. Oh, and we still have candle making, but so far this is the art box. She was able to clean out a lot. 
So it's kind of our last decluttering for today. We could probably fit all of the art minus the fabric just in this box. Mm. That would be great. And we'll just label this. So I think we'll go ahead and store the guitar somewhere else. Aren't those labels nice? Yes. Very convenient. We're gonna take a minute to put everything up, calm the chaos a little bit. get to all the stuff that you've seen hiding over here but in order to uncover the baskets we have to move to the skincare so it is going to be a bit of a shuffle I think we'll end up putting the bags right here Yum. all right okay and these are the wicker baskets that we need for electronic organizing candle organizing but right now they're being used so we have to shuffle them because it will all make sense very soon how are those fitting? Are they okay? Pretty good so far. Some of them might be too big, huh? It kind of stretches out a little bit, but like some of these, they, they're okay to... <sighs> Feels good. Now the plan is to switch up what was hanging on her door with her toiletries, which is why we moved the purses into the other room. <laughs> this might be better on the door for, in that door for hanging possibly. Mm -hmm. This is what we're planning to put on the door. Is it pretty easy? Does it just... Yeah, it just sets over the edge. So it shouldn't stick out too far once we take the shoes off the back. It'll stick out less than what everything else was. Was before. Yeah, how it was before. Yeah. So now is the time that we load this baby up. The plan is to relocate the skincare. We have a new space for perfumes, but we'll put skincare and makeup on this shelf where it's easy for her to grab. I was worried about leaving these like the, this for her because I knew over time it would just kind of add up. So this will be so yes. nice on the wall. I'm really excited to see how this works. Okay, I guess let's divide one for makeup and right now just rough organization and later uh -huh. you can go through and you can make it perfect however you want. Okay. Today with me, it'll just be kind of quick to get you a system started. Okay. Oh, that looks good. I have a new home for her perfumes in the living room. So I'm going to relocate that and that should help us have more space on here for toiletries. Hey, I see you just shove these. <laughs> Danielle is already shoving these on the perfume I know, shelf. I don't know where to put my sunglasses. I don't need that right now. I you forgot said, they existed. Yeah. You said they are all in the car. I'm putting some of these that are just too tall up high. Okay, uh, like the room sprays. For okay, how are we doing here? Oh, it's looking good. I like this. It smells so good. Oh, the watermelon one? Oh my yeah. god, is that Bath and Body Works? Nope. Okay, our first empty bin is uncovered for electronics. Danny is working on this. This is looking really good. How do you feel about the organization we got going so far? It's kicking up a lot of dust, oh. but I like how this is out and about. And also I'm being a little bit more careful because now it's not just kind of hidden in my room. This is out for everyone to see. Oh, that's a good so point. I'm going to probably keep it organized and nice and neat at least. Oh, I like that. It's a ca secret it's accountability for you. Yeah. Oh, that's good. And I'm okay with it. So me too. <gasps> okay. Okay. I will take these. We will let Danny finish. It's a lot of tedious little things and sorting for how she wants to use it. And I will work on the not so tedious things. So now we have two of these. We have one more basket coming after Danny finishes. We're going to use these to hopefully get a lot of this stuff organized. We might not have enough room for the candles, but she actually told me, she's like, before we started this, I thought I was running low on candles. And now we found all of these, which is just so funny. So I'll start working on all of this stuff for her. Except for this. Oh, and except for these two big ones, we're able to fit all of the candles in here. That works. Next one will be for, oh, ah, batteries, More batteries. And then there is, there are some loose candles in here. So we'll just throw them. Oh, Adam. Oh, I found some more Halloween. I think with batteries, I'll add tape and tools. 
Last one, I'm thinking we have a lot of electronics and we don't have the best storage right now. Have you gone through these? No. Okay. So before I store them away, I will, I'll put them in here first. We'll look at them in a minute. We have one basket of mini candles, many, mini candles. This one is kind of home goods miscellaneous. We have batteries, chair protectors, flashlights, select electric cable, some tape, some paint for the house. Let's see, I think I'm gonna save this last one for electronics. Okay, I'm gonna put electronics here. And a little toolbox, I think we can slide. Oh, it doesn't fit. Oh, we'll put that there. I think that's all done. She's just so cute. Anywhere I go, she keeps moving the bone to me. Look at this. Oh, baby, I gotta work. I'll never finish organizing at this rate. Look at this. <laughs> I gotta go over here. I gotta go over here. Okay, I got it. Oh my gosh. So, this one is... Home We're gonna have to curate it later, but yeah. home maintenance, batteries, cameras, flashlights, tape. Here's the paint, paint. that you needed. Mm -hmm. uh, tools, a hammer. And then tools are up here. It's the best way they can fit. All this is is an extension cable. Mm -hmm. So I thought, as you know, the electronics declutter, you could just add more cables yes. here. And this last one is all just the candles. candles. Uh -huh. okay. The not the big ones. They didn't fit, but this is all this candle stock. Yeah. <laughs> and then this is just the leftover gift. So mm -hmm. this is all very practical, I think. Yeah. Checking on Danny's progress. She still has extra space, which is nice. Oh, I like that you put the cotton pads down there. Out of the way, that's very nice. And how much... We can fit this. Oh, yeah. We can definitely fit it. It's just a matter of, like, getting it organized as you go. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is what Danny has going so far. The pile has been minimized. And tell us your genius idea. I love um, this. Reusing what you already have. So I got an espresso order in the other day and that's it beautiful a little clear storage container yeah. it's supposed to be for the coffee pods but i actually like my system for the coffee pods a little better it's a little perfect elastic. so what are you gonna do with this one um lipsticks if i don't see them they don't get used and so i feel like this would be a great way to kind that's of... so cute it inspires you to actually pick a new yes. lipstick every day i like mm -hmm. it try it out and see how you like it and i think clear storage is going to be a game changer for you wow it looks good can i take this off for now absolutely look at that i it just looks so good we're gonna put her jewelry on here something that she'll go through another day because it's so tedious but she can have it out right here so i think this will be do you think you'll like this new setup? I think I will. I think it's going to look good. Oh my gosh, look at that. We still have a ways to go tonight, but look at this. Oh, it looks so good. Mm -hmm. I love the box with the lipsticks. That was such a good idea. I'm actually pretty proud of myself for thinking yeah, of that. You <laughs> are. You're like clear storage. I'm like, do I have anything clear? I do. Yes. Okay, this is the end result of this storage. I think it looks really good. And, and we've talked about... I'm not getting oh, yeah. shoulder checked walking in. So right? I'm okay with that. With the coats, I was getting shoulder checked. Yes. So this is a huge improvement. And we talked about... Right now, it's just... It's, it was organized. It got more unorganized as we went. But we talked about using down your stock. And she's pretty mm -hmm. convinced this is going to get smaller. So she's going to now be able to see if it's something that she uses. And if not, she said she's ready to toss it. So... It'll just take her a few weeks, I think, to go through that, see what you use, and then it'll consolidate. Yeah. Oh, it looks so good. I'm excited. You are? I am. Because, like, I put the primary stuff that I use at eye level. Mm hmm So, in the hopes that that is something I will use regularly. And actually being, having everything out, I just feel like I'll use it more often. I totally agree. And it won't get buried. And it's not buried. Here. Because I can even see it from underneath. You can, and if you are sitting on the sofa now and it's getting out of control, you'll be like, uh huh. Mm -hmm. I love it. Yep. Woohoo! Good. Okay, ready for the next organization transformation? 
on to the next one. Right now we're talking about the home decor. We won't redecorate tonight. This is something she can do at another time. So we're talking about where we can store it in the meantime. And the idea with this is that when she's ready to decorate, she'll use it or she'll declutter it. But I like to wait till the last minute so that she doesn't, you, know, <laughs> you never know, you might wanna use it. Do you think that you will be accountable enough to put it, like declutter it when the time comes? I'm not going to let myself even be tempted to leave it. Okay, I'm perfect. moving it out of the I space where it would be out of sight, out of mind. And I'm going to put it into a place where I'm going, going to, to have it. to face it, use it, address it, take care of it, apply it, or get rid of it. I love it. Okay, yeah. so we're going to put all of the artwork over here in the mm -hmm. art department. In the art department. In the art department to go through later. I feel confident in you. Thank you. You gained my confidence over the last few days. That feels really good. <laughs> I'll let you store the artwork while I work on this other little stuff. I'll just move it out of your way. Some more art. I just have like a big goofy grin right now. This is this has been such a transformation. Like Yeah? I, we're not even done with your we're room not yet. <laughs> even done. Let's get the last of this stuff out. Right now, the important thing is to like not get lost in all the tedious stuff. Uh -huh. To do the big changes and come back for the small stuff later. She's going to use this on its side for the bookshelf. And later, whenever she goes through her bookshelf, it's actually overflowing right now. She can bring some of the rollover books here. We'll put it here for now. Holy cow, look at this. Yay! That's I still like me to sit with a little foldy table and have fun here in a moment. Look at all of this space so far. This is pretty much done for now. Like we said, it's going to evolve over time and she's going to go to the store later, buy a better container. This is pet stuff. We still have pet food and stuff that we need to store over here, but at least it's there. It's out and open for her to see and make use of. We have this huge empty space. What do you think, Lucy? The last thing we're going to do is bring, we have the kind of the clothes, I think is mostly last step. One of the next steps, we'll say. Mm -hmm. Clothes. We're going to bring clothing racks in here. I think they're going to fit perfectly on this wall. This is amazing. Wow. Ta-da. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait to see your bedroom after this. This is so exciting. Okay, this is the next... The next rack we must uncover. Alright, Luz, watch out. I think the hanger. Ooh. Shall we go enjoy the empty space <laughs> of the other room? Oops. Okay, we're gonna put all of the boxes back here. It's a great little hiding place for them. All right, Ricky, let's go clean up the room. I will go ahead and start taking some of these jackets to the other room. We're just swapping I do the out same the jacket thing. hangers. <laughs> We've got all of the jackets put away. Is there a Lucy in there somewhere? Yep, there is. She's okay. reluctant to come out. I just need to take all the clothes to the other room now. Yes. I just... It's almost midnight. We've been working today for 12 hours. We are exhausted, but we think it's better to just power and push through tonight. We just had ourselves a coffee. Ricky and I had ourselves a very enjoyable playtime. I think the next best thing to do is to put a bow on this room to finish it and then work in the other room. What are we going to call the new room? It's not the doom room anymore. It's not the doom room. My back is almost out at this point, but I still really want to get these to the other room. I might be able to empty them. I started emptying one. Okay, I think I figured it out. You figured it out? Yep. What'd you figure out? I I'm gonna swap leggings there. for pajamas. I like that. I think that's really smart. We have three of these. These are in the bottom of the dress closet. Mm -hmm. We still have summer clothes that we need to put away, but I feel like these are priority because these are daily use mm -hmm. and we want to get rid of or not really use these 
bins that weren't working for we you. We can get rid of them. So we can use three for organizing all of this stuff, which it looks like we have what? Totally leggings? Doable. Some of them are leggings, so I think I'm going to put uh -huh. the leggings with the okay. leggings. Okay. The tomatoes with the tomatoes. Tomatoes with the tomatoes. And the potatoes yeah. with the tomatoes. The this is how tired I am at this point. I just said something about Jackson. What did I? I said he's a potato. He's such a potato. <laughs> I don't know. Because I was he goes like, to sleep. <laughs> I was like he's such a potato because he goes to bed at nine thirty p.m. I was just meaning like I don't even know. And she was like, "What's a potato?" Did you just call your husband a potato? It didn't even face like. I could have swore I was saying, I was trying I to say something, man. but I just, potato <laughs> is the only word that came out. <laughs> Woo, I'm delirious. Grandpa um, equals potato. Yes. Okay, so do you want me to take those shirts in there then? Yes, please. Those are workout? Okay. I will fold them in a second, but right now I'll deliver them. Not a priority. <gasps> Leggings in a basket? In a basket. Should we put sports bras with the sportswear? Is there space sports for that? Sportswear, pants, let's make space. There might not be space. We'll see. Those are going to go in the back of that. Oh, okay, perfect. I'm just yeah. going to actually pass them to you. I'm talking about having like a fire brigade line the whole day, and I finally get one at midnight. <laughs> a what line? <laughs> like a fire oh. brigade line. It's a and burrito. Trash. Okay, um, look at that. Okay, so we don't all even... All of that, we've only got one basket. That's amazing. Okay, I'm going to like... like <laughs> proud of my harvest right now. That looks really cute. <laughs> I like it. Dun dun! Um, oh, that looks so good. The bottom. That looks great. Nice and colorful. So we don't even need those other two baskets. I, I mean, think I'm going to put the other, the swimwear in the other one and then park it down there. Great, because we also have a wetsuit. Oh, yeah, we do have a wetsuit somewhere. And we have all this stuff on the floor. We have workout pants and shirts and then in here workout pants so we have okay. to add that together right now i just threw it in the same vicinity that's fine these are all empty now Whee! where should we move these guys to we can park them in the kitchen love it it makes me really happy that we have this extra basket because it's really going to come in handy in the other closet so this guy we could move here or we could scoot it down a little bit. Mm -hmm. Away from the door. Yeah, just further down. Then it might help open up the entryway a mm -hmm. little bit without having to rearrange is... everything. Mm -hmm. And you can always get creative with stuff later after, you know, we have more energy. <gasps> and then if we put that over against that, this will lean against the wall. And then I <gasps> have more art space. You have a lot of art space. No longer just the art department. For a moment, I can order another one. Want to leave it a little bit away from the wall? Hmm. You can put your mirror. I always wanted to hang this on that wall. Always. But I'm afraid it's too heavy and it's going to pull down the wallpaper. Yeah. Even more. Things are really starting. This feels like a completely different bedroom. You could not walk. In front of, like, on the side of the bed, in front of it, when I was here. And now she just scooted the bed over, because she's incredibly strong. <laughs> and she can now shimmy down that side of the wall. Uh-oh. Everybody's so happy now with all the extra space. What did we, what did we just find? Found some more candles. Under, under my bed? I don't know how they got there, <laughs> perfectly honest. No idea how they got there. Um, another autumn in the park. There's now two of them. All of these pillows go on the living room sofa, but right now it's awesome. full. <laughs> it's full, but we're celebrating this room. And then she can soon put all of our artwork up, shuffle things around. This is the electronics, but not tonight. No, we don't have the energy for that. This just looks amazing. So empty. Not only do I have the physical space to move things around, I also have the mental space to do it. Does it feel like a different room than when Absolutely. we started? Absolutely. Yes. <laughs> this is this is to be continued. This is the mess. We still have to clean up tonight. And now Okay, you're just making that work for now? Yep. Okay, that's the mood where, that's where we're at, everybody. Actually, this all kind of fits in here, so... You're fine with that like that? I'm, 
I will tidy it up later, but for now, it's, it's awesome. good. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so now we have two shirts and one in this basket. What were those? Those were dresses. Oh, okay, perfect. So we can hang those off. Okay, swimsuits. And there's a wetsuit around here, but I think it's in that. It's right here. Oh, it's convenient. Okay, we're going to add the wetsuit to the swimsuits. You put the lime in the coconut. <laughs> that is just who we are right now. It is. I need a little lime in my coconut through. Wait, we're not sure what we're going to put on the top one yet, right? Uh-uh. Oh, I have an empty basket. We have an oh empty basket. Oh my gosh. How did this happen? You know, I got discouraged early and was like, I'm going to have to come back. But it's before I realized we had three of these empty. And then when I realized we had three more, I said, I can push through. Just give me coffee. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that feels so good. All right. I have an idea. All right. I like your ideas. This is my idea. To hang up all the clothes, we're going to sit on this cushion so that our butts don't hurt and our ankles don't freeze up on us anymore. And we're just going to power through hanging this stuff up. Yeah. Okay. Sound good? Sounds good. Oh, we could put pants in that drawer. I sport it. Or shorts. Jeans. Shorts are harder. Jeans would be better here. Shorts, shorts are pain to hang. Uh, do you know what time it is? I just looked. Uh, it's probably like one now, isn't it? No, it's twelve eleven. So is it really? I feel like we we're home. We're past. Yeah. Now I feel like we, that coffee's kicking in, and I'm ready to go till six a.m. Not really. <laughs> I'm out. The tank top that can go into my bedroom. I feel like we need to go through and cite all of the songs that you and I have been singing throughout the day, and like make a soundtrack. <laughs> I've just been humming. I don't even know what's coming out of my mouth. If I'm being honest. <laughs> Should this go to the scarf department? Yes. You're getting... Now I feel like after tonight I really will have known you for a year. <laughs> if six... If five days could be a year. I don't know if Jackson will still be awake. He said he was, but, you know, he is a potato after all. He's a potato. <laughs> oh, I found, we found the swimsuits. So the other swimsuits. Yay. Oh, hey, please be all swimsuits. They are. Stop hanging out. No, oh, these are. <laughs> what are these? Oh, these are shorts. Oh, and these are shorts. You said. I was gonna put the fabric shorts separate oh, from the jean shorts. For sure. Mm. What would you like me to do with all the hangers that are in our way? Take them down, put them in a bag. Oh, I've got a bag, and everything's really working out for us yes. at this point. Every yes, finally, finally. We can let this out. Okay. Yeah. All hangers, goodbye. Okay, it goes in here. You're not gonna forget about that? I mean, how could you? I live in shorts. Yeah. Yeah, she'll come find me. Okay, we have transformed this room. This is the first pass of decluttering and organizing, and it will continue to transform. But this is an incredible start. Over here, we have musical instruments and art. This is something that's going to continue paring down over time, but right now we have it stored over here. We have all of her decor that she can go through and use to decorate her house. This is going to be for books. We have her bag storage and her clothing rack will get more organized, but she said tonight, let's not do that now. This is something I can do later. Over here, we've shown you guys this before, but we have vacuum. She's still going to pare down. These will eventually go each to their own room. And then she needs to get a better storage container for the pet supplies. This is kind of the storage closet room, but it's so nice that it can all be tucked out of sight. But when she opens it, she can still read her labels, find all of her stuff. It's all very visible, but it doesn't have to be open like this all the time, you can put it behind closed doors. Up here, we have the start of her towels and bedding. She's gonna go through bedding again later, and this will all move to the chest in her room, but right now we're gonna set it up here. Her closet looks so good. This is the dress closet, and we have her bags tucked away in here, no longer on the door where you're bumping into them. Here we have a lot of summer stuff in here actually stored in these baskets. I think this just looks so good. 
And again, it's so nice that you can just close the door. Over here, we have all of her jackets and sweatshirts. We have some ski pants down on the bottom. I think Kitty was crawling in there, so they're kind of funny. In here, she has loungewear, or sorry, she has workout gear, and she said, I think she was too tired. She said, well, I'll come back and fold these later, but we just wanted to put them in a drawer tonight. And then, hi. And then we have this for um, scarves, but this looks so good. And most importantly, you can finally see her window. That was one thing that she really wanted. So it'd be fun for her to put some more plants there, I think. I have a floor to die on. Oh, she's done. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dead. I can die and die happy because I have a clean house for the first time in my adult life. I feel empowered. You do? I do. Did you ever think this room could get to this point? Maybe when I was moving out. <laughs> this is empty. But never with me living in it. It is it, absolutely insane that we were able to accomplish, to accomplish this feat. First of all, thank you. I will absolutely say like, comment, and subscribe <laughs> to... I didn't tell her to say that. <laughs> and buy her book. <laughs> and buy her book, yes. You'll I'm, be you'll I'm be in so it. I'm so excited. I'm rewriting some chapters as we speak, even this morning. This is a perfect example of how powerful quick wins are in your home and how you have to start by mentally overcoming the obstacles of decluttering. That's what it's that, about. That was what lit the fire for all of this. Like that first little like hit of oh, I can do this. Yeah, because you did this all on your own. I just helped move things along. Like you really did it did. well thank you but you really, you really did all of this my space has been made